Chronic inflammation underlies a huge amount of the chronic diseases we experience. And a primary marker in the blood we can measure is something called high sensitivity C-reactive protein. Now this fascinating study published by the American Heart Association found that a plant-based diet works better for cardiovascular health than the diet recommended by, ironically, the American Heart Association. The participants all had coronary heart disease and were randomised into two groups. Half were put on a plant-based diet and the other half on the American Heart Association's recommended diet for eight weeks. And the researchers found that high sensitivity C-reactive protein levels improved significantly more among the plant-based group than those on the American Heart Association's diet. So now let's hear from Dr. Joel Kahn, a highly respected cardiologist, who amazingly has been inside more than 15,000 hearts as he shares why this study is so significant and then two simple changes people can make to improve their health. The famous EVADE trial from New York University and it is one of the most concerning markers I run on every patient, marker meaning a blood test, called high-sensitivity C-reactive protein. It's actually giving us clues through simple blood tests that your arteries are inflamed. Think about a rash. Think about even acne. Do you want your arteries to have that on fire appearance because that's where strokes, heart attacks, and other acute problems occur. So by just eight weeks of substituting a burger for perhaps a bean soup and a gas station McMuffin for a bowl of oatmeal, to be able to influence and calm and cool down and like an extinguisher, just turn off that inflammation. Those were the results of that randomized study. Imagine if you did it for eight months eight years, 18 years and beyond. So ask your doctor to measure your inflammation and then just mimic that study and adopt a whole food plant-based diet and retest maybe in eight or 12 weeks. I see people routinely benefit. And the cool thing is their hands, their joints, their brain fog, which are all signs of inflammation clinically, often get better very quickly. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up Leave a comment below and subscribe for more upcoming videos.